It's Jersey Watch. Hey, what's going on, y'all? Cully from Jersey Watch Blog. We're here at the Met Philly. I'm sitting inside by somebody historic inside of the city. So historic, he got a citation today from the city. Jordan Ramsey, how you feeling, baby? I'm feeling good, man. I just wanna look, I just wanna thank God. I wanna thank my family. Yeah. If without them, I wouldn't be in this position. No, real shit, bro. That shit was a shock to me. I didn't even know that shit was gonna happen. But it was a humbling experience because like I like I told some people, when they talk about you a certain way, even if somebody don't know you, that's the way they view you yeah. now. So it's like now you have a certain level of expectation for every person that didn't know you before, but know you from that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So like for me, it's just keeping my mind focused, having fun, but at the same time, just keeping your mind focused. There's so much more shit you could do. So that's the main thing for me, bro. How does it feel? I mean, you and the City of Dreams are giving out opportunities. We're here at the Met. We got young kids dancing. We got oh, we got artists performing. How does all of this feel for you? Bro, it feel it feel crazy because it was it's so much work that go into it to where it's like some days you don't even know if it's a, a good day or a bad day, but it's like times like this when everybody show up, you have everybody coming out getting resources, even stopping people on the street that want to get their expungements and different stuff like that, and make all that shit worth it. It's the selflessness of it that make it's, it's like a charge and fill you fill you up with energy. Roger's sister Talia, she working tirelessly, days in, days out, no sleep, just watching her do her thing. That shit also give you a lot of energy as a male. You know what I mean? Seeing a female move around in a way where it's like. And it's not a lot of male figures that even move in that way. So it's like, that kind of puts you in a, like a battery in my back. Like, damn, dog, like, this ain't her job. This kind of sort of, it's, it's somebody like my job. But the niggas I be with, it's our job to do that shit. But you got to learn. You got to learn. You got to know what's right. You got to know what's wrong. You got to know the councilman. So it's like, it's it's crazy. It's overwhelming. But when you see the finished product, bro, that should always be worth it. You know that better than everybody. I you know. do it, bitch. You know how that shit be. I know. Look, I, I'm making it happen with you. You know what I'm saying? I'm proud of everything that you're doing, everything that you're doing, even to be here at the Met Philly today to know that, oh, we got the guys in the building. You know what I'm saying? This is a family reunion for us. So you just joined the interview. Ghetto Reese is in the building. <laughs> how you feel about all this? I mean, we had the Met, just how far all three of us have come to be here today. How do you feel? It's a beautiful thing, man. Like, I'm glad to see everybody, like, you know, made it through the hardships that we did, you know what I'm saying, to get to this point. It's like, a, you know what I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a level up for us, you know what I mean? And I'm proud, I'm proud of him. I'm saying I'm proud of you, I'm proud of me, I'm proud of what everybody doing, man. Like, it's a good thing. You know what I mean? Good vibes. Good vibes. Now, now, I'm going to ask the question for the people that want to know. When are we going to get the tape? Come on, y'all keep playing. I'm going to bring it up. We had the Met Philly. Listen, we got, we definitely going with. Right. We in the production show. Okay, so producer, we waiting for a tape. What's up? That's it. They ain't gonna put everything on me now. That shit ain't cool, man. Look, that shit gonna come soon. I'll say about this summer, y'all gonna be hearing something from them niggas. Very right. Correct. I like that. Look, man, we at the Met Philly. I'm here with my guys, Ghetto Reese, Jordan Rams. We got the producer in the cut. Yo, make sure y'all give y'all Instagram so people can follow y'all and everything that y'all got going on. So, Jordan, you first. Look, you already know what it is. It's, it's Jordan Ramsey. Make sure y'all follow that nigga Cuddy, too. That's my dog. Next time you have an event, make sure y'all holler at that, you know, man. They slide into the picture, you know, man. <laughs> Yo, what's up? It's your boy Ghetto Reese, you know what I'm saying? Follow me on Instagram, Ghetto Reese 3VM. And um, you know what I'm saying? I'm probably everywhere, like Spotify, YouTube, your girl's baby mom, playlist, like I'm around, like it's official Cuddy TV, you already know what the fuck going on, my boy. Yeah, <laughs> come on, buddy, you said you and this y'all. You already up. know, man, it's R3 Banger, man. Y'all can follow me on the gram at R3 B A N G A. You man, get with me and get with this guy for everything y'all need. Yeah. Hey, look, man, we out here, man. Jersey Watch Blog. We here at the Met Philly, Jordan Ramsey, Ghetto Reese. It's a movie, man. I got Q on the camera. Let's get out of here. Thank you.